Hello everyone, welcome back to another tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to extract a color, or actually multiple colors, five colors to be specific, out of any picture, any photograph, any image really that you have. This is very, very useful for you designer guys and gals out there that uh, you go into a into a like into a place you're looking to do some work for. You take a couple pictures, and then you want to get some of those colors, and you want to get the exact colors out of it. Here we go. It's very very simple. The first step is you want to go to color.adobe.com, as you can see here. That's where I've gone. This is what you will see when you click on Adobe Color. The next step, and this one is the trickier one, is you want to go to Extract Theme. Now, as as you can see here on the front on the front page. We've got all these different uh, options on the front, but that's not what we're looking at right now. We want to go to Extract Theme, and then here's where the magic happens. You see drag and drop your file. Let's just select a file from your computer. So I'm just going to select this picture here, and I'm going to hit Choose. And this is a picture of me dressed up like Dora the Explorer. Yeah, guys, for real. Yeah, yeah, you thought I was a regular uh, <laughs> tutorial type guy? You would be wrong. And these are the five colors anyways that selects these five colors directly from it. Now, you will notice a couple things that you can move these around. So if you don't like this gray, let's say, or actually this reddish, ruddy color, you can move it to say something like this. And as I move it, you'll notice I am taking the pick, I am taking the color directly from the image, but it's changing there on the right side. So all of these things are adjustable. So if there's a particular area of the photo that you want, like maybe you want the blue in that section, whatever it is, guys, this is how you get the colors out of an image and it's got these five selected now normally you can click save and it will give you these colors but you need to sign in for that so if you don't have an adobe um a current adobe membership or you're not a current member uh you'll just want to take a screenshot of these colors and then use a eyedropper tool to select the colors or, or drop it into whatever if you do or into adobe illustrator and then you can just uh or Photoshop and just select from it, depending on what your workflow is. If you have a membership, I am signed in on this one here, you will see a couple of other more options available, in particular the save button. And here you'll notice that I'm saving it and I saved it to, these are my library. So I've got a library called Turnkey and I called it, let's call it uh, Dora the Explorer, although that's not what these colors are, but that would be naming the new, the, the, uh, the swatch panel and select some uh, select some tags if you want to click save and then it will go into your um, into one of your libraries so I could select let's say my library save it bang it's in your library <coughs> excuse me <coughs> excuse me sorry about that guys and if I open up my Photoshop for example I've got turnkey open and you'll see here that there it is there's my color theme that I saved and then I also went into my library and I saved it and there it is. When I hover over it, Dora the Explorer. Those are just some of the colors, guys. That's a way to get it, get colors from your image. Come on, Curtis. Use your words. That's it for this tutorial, guys. Got a lot more stuff coming up. Stay tuned. Be back soon.